time I saw this homie, he didn't have dreadlocks. Now apparently he has dreads. And then he's a guy who's put out hits for you like Goody Goody. And also he's got his brand new one, Y E T C. I don't know whether he has a thing for light skins. I'm, uh, he doesn't. I'm yet to find out that one. But he's a very cool guy. Welcome the one, the only, Muluya Wabusiya. People, are you fresh, my head? Yeah, man, I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> I have not seen you in ages, man. Say, I know uh, it's been a while, man. <laughs> Where did you go to, man? I've been around, bro. Guys have to become fat, at least. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm not fat, like him. You know, I'm just I'll just say, size, you know, yes, I'll pick your size. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, it's so good to have you in, bro. Yeah. I mean, I hear that you're a lady killer. I don't know. Because there was a point, there was uh, rumors that there were dramas between Suji Kush, Tracy, Mara, Yvonne, Q. They were fighting over Chris Taff. Aye. Aye, aye, aye. <laughs> what, what was that? Situ- was that a real situation, Nama? I just heard the story, but uh, me, I didn't see that happening. <laughs> you didn't see it, you just heard the story. Yeah. But are you with, are you with Yvonne, Q? That is a very tough question. <laughs> Let me tell you something. <laughs> You know, when you say you're with someone, uh, I have so many friends. I'm with my brother. I'm uh, with my okay. Don't, I'm don't with, try to play one I'm with you. Well. You're my friend. You know, I'm with so many people in my life. So, so are you in a relationship with the Vonda Q? Well, no, we're not in a relationship. Weren't you guys in a relationship, though? Nope. You've never been in a relationship? No. Because in that video for H, the way you guys, yeah, the way you come at her in that video, <laughs> I was like, Christoph. <laughs> I'm putting it's you on called, the spot, it's, huh? it's entertainment. Uh, it's uh. entertainment. At the end of the day. Yeah, that's what it has to be. Mm. And speaking of entertainment, tell me this. Yeah. Would you rather party for three days and have a hanging for three? Mm-hmm. Or would you rather party for seven days and have a hanging for six days? Yeah, for three days. <laughs> <You can't. laughs> for three days is better than six days. <laughs> you won't be productive at all. You know, six days, aye, like when were you going to try to make your money? <laughs> six days, if, if you're dead six days, then that means that whole week you're not making anything. Yeah. Or you're not doing anything constructive. It's all life. gone. Christian. Yeah, it's all gone, yeah. And by the way, there was a point that uh, you were doing a business in terms of cars. You buy a car, put some celebrity value on it and sell it. Are you still doing that? Yeah, that's my part-time. That's your part-time? How yeah. is it going so far? It's cool. Uh-huh. Only in my <laughs> <laughs> And now he admits to it. There's this job I want to hook up for you. The Tippy Toe with Femi One. How did you even come together? It's like, how did you get with Femi One? Because you guys are from two different musical worlds. I brought her into my musical world. Uh huh. Yes. You just told you like, where Guja? No, 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 no. I, actually, uh, her management contacted me and they're like, yo, we need Femion to do something that's commercialized and all. Then I said, cool, you guys organize for a session. Me, I'll come up with the idea. And you, yeah. You know, so What's I came up uh, with the beat, with the lyrics, everything. Yeah. You produced this yourself? I didn't produce it. Like, huh? I guided the producer with what kind yeah. of sound I want. Wow. Yes. That's amazing, man. Mm-hmm. You're becoming like DJ Khaled. Yes. You just sit on the chair. You're like, no, no, yeah, no, 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 no. Don't remove Don't. that. Put that. <laughs> a lot of stuff that he has going on. But are you Tim Duxkin or like? Light skin. Uh, yeah, light skin. <laughs> light skin anytime, man. <laughs> dark skin, yeah, I go, but I also think the same thing. Ah. I'm usually like, I'm already dark skin. Now, if I get a dark skin, Shore will just get navy blue babies. I don't know, you'll get, a, you'll get chakwa. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. You just have my kids being bullied in school. That's not a plan at all. Yeah. When is the Christoph album coming out, bro? Next year. Mid next, mid year. next year, yes. Why aren't you doing it this year, though? Because there's so much, there's so much happening right now. The politics and all that, the elections, you know. Yeah. Right now, you can't. No one is gonna concentrate on my album because <laughs> guys just want to know, okay, who's the next president? <laughs> yeah. So I need to wait for all these things to come down. Yeah. And uh, in terms of the album itself, are you working with any artists? Yeah, probably. I have like two international artists on the album. Oh wow, that's yeah, cool. it's crazy. It's gonna be a crazy album. That's why it took so much time for me to yeah. like come up with this project and who is who are you doing with on production it has to be uh production i have uh, i have a couple of producers mm-hmm. uh, three okay yeah and so it's we, we expect something massive too much <laughs> it's gonna be too much but are you gonna release any singles between now and then yes yes i'm about to release a song in the next like two weeks uh-huh yeah uh, what's your video so give me like a sneak it's, it's called bam bam Hey! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Bamba, me just had to sing about the booty. No, no, no. You see, now that's where you perverted guys. <laughs> no, but it's not like, about the booty. Unless it's the uh, unless it's the another bamba. It's something different. <laughs> you see, you don't know how to twist my words. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Why I'm not trusting you on that one. For real, it's not about uh, booty. <laughs> it's just bam bam. Yeah. You no, know, there's a wrestler called Bam Bam Bigelow. So I, there's a difference between which one from WWF or WWF back in the day. There was a guy called 
I'm, I'm trying to remember. Ba- yeah, ba- Google Bam Bam Bigelow. He died actually. Oh, I think I. Yeah. I you know me, I was old school. Yeah, old school, eh? Yeah. Even I also yeah. used to watch WWF. No, I, was I those don't guys. think so. If you don't know Bam Bam Bigelow, nah, he wasn't the big one. WWF. For, he started watching for those days for Kina Stone Cold and Goldberg. Now I started when Goldberg was big. Those days for Hulk Hogan. Yes, I, Bam and I used to watch when Hulk Hogan was in, but towards the end of his career, though. Oh. So you're a, you're a big wrestling guy. Uh, me, I'm a, even now, me, I watch wrestling. I oh, how did you guy. feel when you discovered it's fake? I did. I don't want to tell myself that. <laughs> I know that, but no. As an entertainer, <laughs> yes. As an entertainer, uh, I just take it as I take it as entertainment. So <laughs> Christoph, you're in denial. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not in denial. <laughs> Dude, you ain't denial. Don't even try. Just don't even console yourself. Wrestling is fake. From mm. the scripts, as it me the time I discovered, I was so disappointed. I was like, I can't deal with this anymore. No. I can't. No, I still watch one. Entertain. Okay, you watch movies, right? Yeah. But it's not real. Yeah, but I know it's not real. Exactly, but, but I know it's not real. But wrestling with, made us believe it was real. No, when they you, lied to us. Even when you're young, you used to watch movies and think it's real. You go to school, <laughs> you watch Bruce Lee, and you want to chop everyone. You want to beat everyone in school thinking you're Bruce Lee. But you see, wrestling lied to us. They gave us this image even of movies. Of, oh, the rock is real. So when he hits this guy, blood like, from Mokazia, like even hey. up to up to date. When uh-huh. chicks watch some. Sad movies, you know, you see them start crying, and then it's fake. <laughs> you get, but that's because it's, their emotions have been touched. Yeah, <laughs> even as our emotions were touched by watching <laughs> movies, chapain guys. So we go back to school. You want to chapa everyone? You get. It's the same thing. Ah, <laughs> uh, this brother is so passionate about this. <laughs> Doing you? Are you like still buds with uh, Calligraph Jones? Yeah. You guys? Still, are you guys putting out any music anytime soon together? Yes. Are you for real? When? Yes. Aki, where are Christopher going to have a secret smoke? Just wait for, you know, the, the, Kenyan, the Kenyan proverbs. Uh. Wait for the elections to end. To go to elections. What's the elections this year, man? Yeah, because I've always been a believer of Christopher and Calligraph. Because you guys came up together. Yeah. I've always been like, man, well. I wish you guys could do like the throne. Remember how Jay-Z and Kanye West had their thing over there? Mm-hmm. You guys should hook up a throne. The Kenyan version. Mm-hmm. Well, come up with something. Uh, you better. Yeah. I'll hold you to we it. We don't want to do the throne. We want to do something different. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I'll hold you to it. Yes. You know how guys always talk about how your oh, Kenyan music is why Kenyan music sucks. Do you agree that we our music actually isn't dope? Our music is very dope. Mm-hmm. You see, the, the problem, uh, the thing I've noticed here is that there are guys for social media, mm-hmm. guys who rant and talk negative things, but the people who really listen to music... They can't get access to even <laughs> to even tell Christoph, hey, your music is work. Why yeah. is your music? You get? Yeah. Because most of these guys probably they're not well off. Yeah. Most of them maybe they live in shags, but they love you, but they don't know how to get you. So the people yeah. who can get you, they they say, hey, yo, me a me a master, me I can't me I can't go say hi to Christoph. I can't I can't take a picture with Christoph. Who is he? You yes. know, <laughs> is that a proverb for Nairobi people? Eh? <laughs> who is he? <laughs> yeah, who is he? Uh, he's a guy we see every day. Hey. <laughs> You know, so me, 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 I know my target when I do music. Mm-hmm. You get, I know my target. So yeah. basically, yeah. So in Busia, you're like a king. You rock up in Busia, and they're like, I was on. Man says, <laughs> you get. So once, once you have your own crowd, uh, yeah. you're, you're you're perfectly fine. You're you don't abs- need, you can't impress everybody. That's true. You can't. You can never. There's somebody out here who says Jay Z's whack. That's true. You know that. Yeah, that's There's true. someone who can't even listen to any Jay Z lyric. Yeah. Because he it just doesn't feel him. And they think. But when he listens awesome. to Migos, <laughs> the like, way people say in Migos, hey, their lyrics are down. <laughs> yeah. But that dude is a Migos diehard fan. Yeah. You know, he buy Migos album and not buy Jay Z's album. Yeah. Yeah. So people are different. So even Migos, there people say, you know what? I, what do these people sing? Yeah. What kind of lyrics are these? You know, they go to Twitter. They send them bad negative comments and all that you know but it doesn't matter this guy still rocks he's still making money so you're wondering i I hate on this guy but he's still getting airplay why because he has his true fans yeah you get hey christopher (laughs) (laughs) i know i know like i'm I'm just saying something i realize you know yeah you can't impress everybody. Yeah, but that's true, man. You can't. Everybody always talks. I mean, one man's yeah. meat is another man's poison. Exactly. It's like yeah. I spot a baby in the street. You're yeah. like, man, that baby's not flying. There's some, there's another some guy is like, like ah, can this <laughs> chick just leave me alone? I'm tired of being with her for six years. That's true. I don't want to see her. You, you're there like, what? Uh, you guys, if I had this thing out there, yeah. yeah. Now that's the thing, yeah. <laughs> and what's there's your favorite difference. jam right now? Kenyan and international. Kenyan. My favorite Kenyan jam right now is Souls. Friend zone. Friend zone. I see 
yes. Yeah. You liked like, it. It's like, hey, it's one of, like, I replay it all the time. Mm -hmm. Mm. There are some people who are saying that they were a bit disappointed lyric wise. Ah, song. Yeah, that song is like. Cause they say the beat. I, I remember there were a couple of guys who were doing reviews on it. They were like, the beat is amazing. It's that song is sound amazing. Sound is in, but now you like, see the those are the people I'm talking off. about. <laughs> are you seeing? Those are the people I'm talking about. <laughs> don't appreciate our own. They, it's not even, they know it's dope. <laughs> they just don't want to accept it. They just feel okay. We need more we need, from you guys. Uh, we need to find something. No. <laughs> mm. And what are your thoughts on how you know guys are hitting at gospel artists? In like how people say gospel music is not really. It's not that they claim it's not quote unquote spiritual. Or well, guys say how you know like the Willie Pauls and Akina Bahati and them put out gospel music but they don't really act like gospel stars you know one thing you can't you can't tell i can't tell you how you how you how you can worship god yeah you have you know how you talk to your god yes so me i can't judge anyone at the end of the day it's music it's entertainment yeah so if you're fooling around with god's name that's up to you you get but then again, if you're entertaining people, I don't think it's Satan who's giving you all the glory. I don't believe that. <laughs> and I also don't believe that. Yeah, so me, I know it's I don't God believe in blessing I you. actually don't believe in yeah. Illuminati. Yeah, so me, I believe if you're doing a gospel song and it's big, yeah. and then guys see you in a club drinking, that's still God who's blessing you to get the hit. <laughs> yeah. I mean, that's what I believe. No, it's true. Because hmm? they say the rain drops on the righteous and yeah. the wicked. Yeah. So still on the same so, Because if God didn't like what you're doing, those songs would have, wouldn't have been big. Hey, songs that guys are hating on. Christopher, I don't think Bibliya. I don't think Saturn has the power to make a song big. Okay, I don't believe. Man, there are people who believe speaking, that. For yeah, me, I don't believe truth. that. I don't believe that. You're actually speaking the truth. I also don't believe. If I say in that, humanity. I think it's like I'm saying Saturn is more powerful than God. That's true. It's like how saying. people usually put him like he's this powerful. Yeah, you know, people say that. Yo, that guy is doing so well. That's Illuminati. Ah, hey, that's, man, that's, guys <laughs> are working hard, man. <laughs> you got a baby girl in your life right now. Baby girl, what do you mean? Like, not a child. Oh. A shorty. A man, girlfriend. Of course, man. <laughs> of course, I have a shorty. I'm a shorty. I have a shorty. <laughs> <laughs> Remember, there was that era when everyone just used to call a chick. Everything was shorty. Shorty. Yeah, shorty. And, and then you have that one weird dude who's like shorty. Yeah. Shorty. It's <laughs> like a real shorty. <laughs> so, do you, do you see? Let us know, bro. What does your girl do? Who is she? Daja Gina, why are you hiding the show? It's not about hiding, man. You know, I'm talking about personal life, man. You never know, man. I'm just going to be a sponsor everywhere, man. I'm going to be a sponsor on Instagram and as such. I'm going to meet your friends, Christophe. I'm going to be a DM. I'm going to be a I'll give you 50 million. They're going to be a DM. I'm going to be a DM. Too many feces out here. Too many feces out here, man. How long have you been dating her? Uh, a couple of years now. Yes. Year. Hey, I thought you were gonna shock me and say like maybe months. Yes. No, no years, man. Bro, you you been, to, you've been loyal to that you team. Need huh? to, you need to have you need to have a, a strong woman behind you for you to be successful, man. Yeah. You can have you can have dudes behind you and be successful. That's a lie. <laughs> Don't you ever lie to you, man. You know when you're tired, you need to go back home. There's someone who's waiting to massage you, cook for you some nice food. You this man is definitely yeah, from you're going home at the hey, hey, you're looking at the fridge, you have to fr leftover fries for Jana, some weird chicken. <laughs> you never concentrate. You get you gotta find that woman, huh? Yeah, man. Every man needs a bay. Every man, man. Ah, but you can just make you be happy. So do you have any children? <laughs> hey bro. <laughs> you, gotta, you know, you gotta say up these things up front, bro. We don't want Kesho, you might talk up for me and then tomorrow I'm just seeing Apple on Pasho.co.ke. Man, say that's what it's I, Yeah, man, say, yo, <laughs> let's just scratch that story for a bit, man. <laughs> so you don't want to say But you're... let me tell you, uh, people know my life. Uh -huh. I don't even need to say it. Uh -huh. So many people know my personal life. I just don't want to give it's the, the bloggers.